Hi guys, Office Bloke Dave here. I hope you're all having a great day. I am enjoying this journey of getting back into reacting to music. I think I'm about six weeks in at the moment and uh, it's great. I'm being exposed to some old favourites. I'm uh, finding some new people. A couple of names that were thrown around two years ago over at Office Blokes React in the comments section and DMs and emails and stuff that I never checked out. Dimash and uh, Elite Bartabi and two of them. No, we did check out Dimash once actually. We never really went down that rabbit hole though. Um, <clears throat> one of the artists that I've come across who I'm so far um, behind the curve with this because they've been around for decades, I gather. The sort of heavy rock side of things was never really my thing. I was always a bit more extreme with my metal taste. So maybe that's why extreme have passed me by. Um, I've only reacted to one song so far and it was Rise. So if you haven't checked that out, wait until the end of this video and go and check it out. It was awesome. The guitar playing was insane. It was kind of like, um, I can't remember the name of them. I've gone absolutely blank. The band of Tom Morello and uh, Chris Cornell. No, gone. It's late. Anyway, it was like them times a thousand, you know, on crack. But uh, I'm looking forward to getting into another one. This is Extreme Banshee. I'm expecting great guitar work. The rest of the musicians are great as well, but just that, that, that solo on Extreme Rise was nuts. <laughs> Chunky. chunky so far I think that's the best word to describe it and it's audio slave I was trying to think of a minute ago that just came to mind out of nowhere yeah they were like the last song I felt like was audio slave on crack but audio slave obviously took a lot of inspiration from the sort of heavy rock bands of the decades before I'm liking this though it's uh, again chunky I'll try and think of another word for it well if we go through but chunky is the only thing I can think then I sting serpentine kiss, knock on it bliss. There's a pain, main light in vain. M -m 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 my heroine, lost in her man, hell of heaven sent. Jesus, make my dying bed. Caught up in a dream, somewhere in between. Head is spinning, bodies with a chest shock, really falling from grace. She 
Nice. I'm getting proper Nightman Cometh vibes from that singer's outfit though. I'm not gonna lie. He had his hand on his hip at the beginning of the song and it was uh, fighter of the day, man. Uh, <laughs> that was good. It was a good tune. For me, not my style. Um, I've never been much of like a rock or heavy rock person. I'm like a metalhead. And when it comes to metal, I like it more extreme as well and more aggressive. That being said, I am an appreciator of it and there's nothing better than back in the day when we go and used to go and watch um used to go to certain rock pubs and watch covers bands that would just be unbelievably talented people playing just rock classics we used to go and do it all the time practically every weekend and I absolutely loved it great live music great to sort of just get pissed to and have a good time with loads of people but yeah I enjoyed it I'm just not it's not quite heavy and edgy enough for me all amazing guitar playing there, amazing musicianship. But yeah, it was good. I'm, I'm happy to listen to more of them. And this is what I was saying about broadening my horizons. I wouldn't usually listen to... There's a lot of stuff I wouldn't normally listen to on here. And I'm enjoying I'm enjoying just delving into everything, to be honest. Anyway, I'm waffling. Let me know what you guys thought of that. Um, I do appreciate your feedback. And if there's anything you want me to check out, comment below. I will try my hardest to get around to everything that people suggest. And uh, yeah, cheers for that one. I'll see you again soon.